Hi friends, today I am going to show you a custom ROM called Camelon OS for the Nexus 4. We had a lot of custom ROMs that are based on 4.3 but almost all of them look alike. But this one is a bit different from the other custom ROMs out there. This ROM is based on 104.3 Jelly Bean. This ROM is still in beta stages so you can expect some bugs. But there is a lot of theme that has gone into this ROM like the trailer, the messaging app which looks very cool to your eye so there is the messaging app which is very nice even though it is in beta stages the ROM is very fast and very stable I am using this ROM from a couple of days but I haven't come across any major bugs other than some force close issues but this ROM is very stable and I definitely recommend it for your daily use we had a custom launcher that's come right, that comes right out of the box so there are a lot of settings so I will show you some of them there is a lock screen it had the slider shortcuts which is very handy so you can add any shortcut directly onto your lock screen so there it is and I will just show you one thing so I will just save that so there are my shortcuts on the lock screen slider so that's a very cool add-on but you are going to get that in any other ROM the theming is one more thing that you are going to get in this ROM which looks very cool so let's get to the system settings where you get a lot of settings there is a status bar settings you can change the battery status style like the icon there is a battery icon you can change it to even percentage circle circle with percentage and a bar which looks very cool there is a bar and you can hide the battery if you want I will go with the bar so you can change the signal status style to text or hidden or you can select the default one so that's about the status bar let's go to the quick settings panel so there are my quick settings the toggles which looks very nice that's about the quick settings panel let's get to the status bar toggles so you can change the toggle layout style to page which is very nice you can tap on notifications or you can just tap on the toggles have the brightness slider there which is very handy and you can use the compact like the normal one which is also very good so I will go with the page you can change the custom toggles position if you want and if you go the this is one of the best things I have noticed in this ROM the sidebar you can select any app and place it in the sidebar and you can access that anytime which is very handy a nice touch to this ROM so there is my sidebar which is work, working very nice so let's get to the other settings there is your power menu so there is my power menu and let's get to the active display which is built in and which is working very nice in this ROM I will show you how this works I will just send myself a little message and I will show you the active display which is built in in this ROM so there it is I received the message even when your screen is turned off and you receive a notification that will show you on your lock screen which is working very nice a very nice add on to this ROM so let's get back to the other options so there are a lot of options on the active display so that's that's about the active display and you had a lot of options in the settings menu you had the this one is one of the best features I have noticed so there are my shortcuts you can just swipe up and turn off your screen or turn on your torch or anything so there is 
there are a lot tons of options to customize in this ROM so let's go to let's get to the other options I'll show you so there is the display UI you can tra transform that to tablet UI if you want that so there is my tablet UI there is my notification panel so you can get back to the phone UI or the tablet UI that's available in this ROM so next one is the buttons and layout you can add a button to the navigation bar like the search button so there it is search button you can add buttons you can add one more button to your navigation bar or uh, if you don't want that you can just uh, delete that or you can just reset to defaults you can change the position of the icon there so anytime you can reset your navigation bar to normal one so next one is the battery light where you have custom colors that will be glowing depending on your battery there is your notification light you can change the colors to any color I will show you that which is working very nice so let's test that so there is my green notification light let's test with another color so there is my notification light which is working very nice so let's get back to the to some other options one more thing which looks cool is the profiles so you can activate any profile at any point of time the other one is the performance option where you can change your performance settings so you can change the minimum CPU frequency and you can say change your maximum CPU frequency and you can change the CPU governor where you had a lot of options if you want to save some power so that's about the performance options so that's about the camera noise guys definitely give it a try I would recommend this for everyone who wants a different ROM on your Nexus 4 with a lot of theming so that's about the camera noise guys the sidebar, the active display which are a couple of nice items in this ROM the ROM is very very fast and very very stable so uh, that one is a nice add-on to this ROM just you can slide up and you can turn off your screen or you can turn on your torch which looks very cool very handy when you are using your Nexus 4 and the last thing I want to show you is the power off and power on option sorry the power off and power off animations I will reboot my device so there it is when you are rebooting you had that cool chameleon OS image there that showing that the device is rebooting but I am sorry guys I can't show you the boot up animation because I am using a custom boot up animation the nexus 4 particles boot animation which is very cool I am a huge fan of this boot animation which looks awesome on your nexus 4 device if you want to install this boot animation do check out my other video I had the download links in the description so don't forget if you, def if you want to try this ROM I will leave all the download links in the description make sure you go to the XDA developers forum and download the ROM and install it on your Nexus 4 device so that's it for now guys don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to my channel for more awesome videos that's it for now it's goodbye